time. Within its swirling mists lies the knowledge of all things, past and future, endings and beginnings. It is all here, hidden from view, waiting to be revealed to those who have eyes to see. Far to the north, beyond the windswept peaks of the spine of the world, beyond the realms of men who call themselves civilized, dwell a people whose way of life is built upon the gift of sight. Among the tribes of the Uthgard, the visions of a shaman serve to guide his people through the fog of an uncertain future. So it was with Yoldair, elder and shaman to the tribe of the bear. For it was his visions that foretold the return of a slain king awakened from the halls of death by a spirit consumed by vengeance. His vision carried him across the tundra to a place where men built their homes beneath an ancient oak with branches that stretched skywards to embrace the clouds. It is here that his vision showed him the faces of the strangers that would journey far across a sea of ice and snow. To the frozen north, these heroes would come, drawn into a twisted maze of shared destinies that would lead us all into the cold and terrible heart of winter. speaks true. You are the heroes from my dreams. Our paths have not crossed until this day. I am Yoldair, son to Refrik, elder and shaman to the tribe of the bear. The vision is why I have come to this place. Tempas has guided me to you. This I cannot say. I know only that the storm of war darkens the skies of my homeland. My people are gathering in numbers greater than any have seen for generations. A king, both new and old, has risen to lead the tribes against the Ten Towns. Already, the first snows of winter bear the dark stains of spilt blood. You must come to Hengoro, to the great mead hall where the tribes have gathered. You alone can forestall the war between our peoples. Though we journey towards the same destination, our paths are not one. My place is at the side of my king. Already I have been gone too long. From here, you must go alone. The people of this town will know the way to the camp of my people. Travel swiftly and safely. We shall meet again when you stand before the council in the great mead hall. 